This tutorial goes along with Excel Project 3. To begin, go ahead and open Microsoft Excel. And then when we refer to our instructions, um, it tells us we're going to use columns A through F. We do have to do our formatting for our headings. We are going to use the internet to find pricing on our automobiles. Um, and then we're going to learn how to do subtraction to find our sold price and then we're going to do some extra formatting. So we'll get everything set up and then we'll look back to our instructions step by step to make sure we don't skip anything. In A1, turn your cap lock on and key in automobiles. We don't have a subheading so we'll skip row 2. That takes us down to row 3. This is where we'll key in our column headings. You can just hit a tab after you type each one to take you to the next column. Okay, now I am going to widen uh, my columns just a little bit so I can see all of my column headings and then we'll go ahead and do an auto adjust before we finish everything up. All right, let's key in our car models. And then we'll key in our car makes. Okay, we don't know our prices yet, so we're going to skip over to interest and we'll key these in. Now when we key in our interest rates, we need to be careful um, and key them in correctly. So we either have to type the percentage symbol in or we have to type them as a decimal. So I'm going to type them in as, as decimal. So I'm going to do 0 .055, 0.023, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.025, 0.
So for this one, I have 21, 8, 8, 8. Now your numbers will be different than mine uh, because you'll be searching at a different time of year. So make sure you just uh, put in all of the correct criteria and then we'll choose the top one on the list. So we're going to do 21, 8, 8, 8. And then we'll come back and we're going to change. This time we want to do a Ford Focus. So we'll change our make to Ford. And we'll go to View Used Inventory. And then we want to change our model. So we'll scroll down. And we want to do the focus. So I have to expand that. Okay, so again, I'm just going to choose the top one and your number will be different. Okay, you're going to go ahead and continue that process and find amounts for the other three cars. All right, once we have those prices in, uh, we need to calculate the sold price. And for the sold price, it tells us that we're going to subtract 500 from the actual price that we found. So we're going to do this with a simple formula. In Excel, to do a formula, we type in the equal symbol to begin with. That tells the computer, hey, you're going to do some math for me. You're going to make a calculation. Now I'm going to click on the first number under price, which gives me C4. Then I'm going to do minus, which is our hyphen. And then I'm going to type in 500. And then I can go ahead and press Control Enter. It will show me my price, 21,388. So is that $500 less than our price? It looks like it is. We'll do the same thing on each of these other rows. Okay, all of our data's in. So let's go ahead and work from the top to the bottom and do our formatting. So in cell A1, our main heading, we're going to make it bold, 15 point, and then we need to merge and center it across our table. Our last column that we're using is column F, so I'll highlight A1 through F1, then choose Merge and Center. Then our column headings are on row 3. Those need to be underlined and centered. Okay, uh, the numbers in columns C and F need to be currency with two decimals, so I'm going to highlight the numbers in column C, hold down Control, highlight the numbers in column F, then go up to my number group, click on the drop down next to general and choose currency and make sure it has two decimal places showing. All right, column D, it tells us to format those to percent with one decimal, we already did that. And then format column E to short date, we did that. Now we need to adjust our column widths. Now in the past we've had us individually adjust our columns one at a time like this, but we can actually Move our mouse pointer on top of the letter A and you get this black um, arrow pointing down. If you click and hold and drag across through column F, then release your mouse and come over to the line between F and G, we get that two-headed arrow, we double click, it adjusts all of our column widths at the same time. So that's a little faster. Okay, do a control home, run a spell check, F7. Make sure you fix any errors that are there. We want to center horizontally and vertically. So go to Page Layout, launch the Page Setup group, click on the Margins tab, check horizontally and vertically. Now here's a new thing, change our orientation to Landscape. We have not done that before. To change to Landscape, you're going to go to your Page Layout tab, and then in the Page Setup group, there's an Orientation button. We'll click on that orientation button and choose landscape. Okay, then we're going to turn on our grid lines. Grid lines are found on the page layout tab in the sheet options group. We're just going to put a check mark next to print only on the grid lines. We don't want headings checked, only grid lines. All right, we're going to save this project and then we're going to make a few changes. So we're going to go to File and Save As, 
and then go ahead and change to your student folder and then go into your computer tech folder into your Excel folder and we're going to name this project 3 alright now we're going to continue on with step 13 and we're going to make some changes it tells us to insert a new column in front of column A so I'm gonna click here on column A and then I'm going to go to my home tab and then go over to my cells group and click on the insert button and that should add a column right in front of column A now we get that little paintbrush and our choices are to format the same as the left or the same as the right uh, we are going to be moving stuff around so let's go ahead and just do a clear formatting we don't want it formatted as anything and then it tells us we're going to cut column F and move it to column A. So we're going to highlight our text here in column F and then I'm going to come up to my clipboard and click on cut. You can also do control X if you want to use the keyboard shortcut. Puts little marching ants around that to tell us what we have saved on our clipboard right now. I'm going to come to cell A3 and I'm going to click on paste which the keyboard shortcut is control V now it has some pound symbols that's just telling me that my column is not wide enough so I'm going to come here and I'm going to double click on column A to adjust that now it tells us that we want to delete column F so I'm going to come over here and highlight column F do a right click and go down to delete next up it tells us to copy columns A and B from the column headings down so I'm going to highlight columns A through B come up and click on copy and it says to paste them below the current column A and B but we're going to leave one blank row so that puts me in A10 and then I'll click on paste then we're going to add a new column C so I'm going to click here in cell C10 and we're going to type in customer and then I want you to add your your own name next I want you to add the name names of four of your friends alright now we've made some changes here so we need to make sure that we have all of our formatting correct still we're going to come up to our heading customer and make that underlined and centered and then we do need to readjust all of our column widths because of the changes we made and that makes column C a lot wider now if we look at our heading automobiles it is not centered over our entire table anymore because it's not centered over A1 so I'm gonna highlight A1 all the way to F1 click on merge and center it removes the merge and center then click on it a second time and it adjusts that and includes column A now make sure you run a spell check again to check for spellings with your friends names and we want to save our changes that we've made so I'm going to click on the save button and then we want to go to print preview okay it looks like we are missing our header across the top of this so we're going to go back to our insert tab and then we're going to go to the header and footer button in the text group and in the, nef in the left side we'll put our name in the center we'll put our class period and over here at the right we're going to click on the file name button to add our file name now if I go up and look at my print preview okay I've got my header showing here's my spreadsheet make sure it's showing your grid lines make sure your column widths are all correct and that it's definitely in the center of our page and our page should be in landscape so the long ways goes from left to right if everything looks okay we're ready to change this to a PDF so we'll come here and click on save and send create PDF keep the name the same project 3 you can go ahead and close that PDF and you're now ready to submit your file to canvas